first two, kind of rounding a bit, but the first two weeks you ran for 500 yards in the last four, about 600 yards. What's been different recently within the last month? Run that back one more time then? In the first two games, Mississippi State rushed for about 500 yards. In the last okay. four weeks, about 600 yards. So what, what, what do you think has changed in those, those games? I, I think as an offense, we're getting better each week. So I think that's one of the things that uh, – we gotten better each week, and so our run game is getting better each week. You know, again, that's one thing as coaches, you always want to see improvement from your team. And I think week after week, we're starting to get better, better, and better. And again, that comes with the young group we got, they're gaining experience. So the more they play, the more experience they get, the better we get as an offense. What did you see out of Harris, especially in the second half of the night? He ran hard. You know, I, I think. Uh, uh, again, I think a lot of credit goes to our old line. They gave him some opportunities, and he took advantage of them. You know, I, I thought we really blocked well in the second half. Our old line came off the ball. We started moving the line of scrimmage, and he did a good job of taking advantage of it. Speaking, speaking of areas, Dan talked about he's learning other things, as in like pass protection and run blocking, just all the other things that go with running back. What kind of things has he done in practice to kind of improve on all those other aspects? Of he's the working. Game? You know, he's working. He knows he's got to learn everything. He's got to be de detailed on everything he does. And uh, I think he's becoming that player we want him to be and we expect him to be. And uh, the more de detailed he becomes, the better player he's going to be. You know, when Brandon wasn't going to get to play last Friday night, did, Eric, did you notice anything different about Eric? Did he see it as an opportunity to kind of get more carries and establish himself a little better? I think they all did. I think they all saw it as, as an opportunity. You know, and uh, when you get an opportunity, you got to go out and make it happen. And, and I thought he did a good job of that, uh, of seizing the moment, you know, uh, Again, taking advantage of that opportunity and uh, playing at a, at, a, at a high level is what we talk about, and I think he did that. Dan yeah. talked about explosive plays. What can the running backs do to create more explosive plays? Got to break more tackles. You know, once the old line gets us in the secondary where we're one-on-one -on -one with the safety or the cornerback, then we got to win those plays. You know, that's where you create the big plays, when you're able to make a safety miss or you run through their tackle with your low pad level. So those are the things we like to see. Uh, from here on out is once we're able to get into the secondary, you know, make it in a bigger play than just a nine to ten yard game. Is it frustrating that you hadn't been able to get some of those, you know, those redshirt freshman running backs in, you know, Nick and, and Alec, you know, hadn't been really in position so far this season? I wish we had, wish we could, wish we did have some of those opportunities, but like I say, we haven't been in those uh, situations. So, you know, hopefully sometime soon maybe we will be able to get those guys in the game and, Again, I'd love to see uh, them in a live situation run the ball. With Holloway out, I guess, again, questionable this week, how do you kind of divvy up those number one reps? Uh, no, no particular way. We just look at it during the week of practice. We grade them every practice, and then we just go from there and make a decision on who's going to start. And, and then, you know, if you start, that's good. But, you know, the other guys want to play too. So, you know, everybody's got to be ready to play and ready to take advantage of their opportunity.